Congressman King, the, the would-be suicide bomber is actually a double agent. What can you tell us about it and, and about him? And it's, I'm in a position, I really can't tell you very much at all. I've been briefed on this. As far as I know, this has not been in any way declassified by the CIA or by the administration. And uh, it's really, to me, unfortunate that this has gotten out because this could really interfere with operations overseas. And I'm sorry to do this. I really cannot comment on any of those details. I know what's out there. I know it's being reported. And I also was at a briefing this afternoon with top officials. And there's a really great concern that this got out. This is, uh, my understanding is, a major investigation is going to be launched because of this. Uh, you, you were also briefed yesterday. We talked to you yesterday about what details you could say. Are, are there right. any new details that you can say? I don't, I don't believe so, uh, Anderson. I hate to do this to you. I mean, yesterday I, I did say to you that uh, I was told, and I could say yesterday, that uh, the uh, bomber, the alleged bomber, uh, was no longer of any concern to us. And now I guess a different interpretation can be put on that than everyone was you know, reading into it last night. But uh, from what I understand, I'll be surprised if you find anyone confirming this on the record, what you're reporting. Uh, now, again, by tomorrow, the next day, it could be a different story. I will say this is the most, one of the most sophisticated and successful intelligence operations that I've been aware of. I've never seen anything so uh, tightly held. Uh, it was uh, held as close, as close as anything I've ever seen. And that's why the leak, when it uh, broke, I guess, about a week ago, uh, really put a lot uh, put a lot at risk, including human lives. And uh, even now, the fact that it's coming out uh, can can be dangerous.